Day one of the biggest 3D printing trade show, Form Next 2025, is officially a wrap. Let's dive into what we saw today. We kicked things off at the Spanish Pavilion with Adamat, the association bringing together Spain's entire 3D printing ecosystem. Spain is this year's official partner country at Formnex, and you can really feel their momentum. From machines to materials, this pavilion shows just how much innovation is coming out of Spain right now. I stumbled across the Spanish Pavilion where I ran into Sarah, who's a representative of Adamat, and she's gonna tell us what visitors can expect to find in the Spanish Pavilion during Formnex. So welcome to the Spanish Pavilion. Uh, we are Adimat, the Spanish AM Association, uh, representing more than 100 uh, industries. And here in Formnex, we are with uh, 10 association members and showcasing the latest uh, technologies uh, regarding machines, parts, materials, and post-processing. Wonderful, thank you so much, Sarah. Beyond the pavilions, one of the biggest eye-catchers came from Caracol, the Italian-American company redefining large format 3D printing. They unveiled a 3D printed catamaran built using the robotic composite system, a striking demonstration of how additive manufacturing is scaling to full size and end-use production. Every corner had something new. High-speed metal systems, biomaterials, and AI-powered design tools that literally reimagine production. One highlight, the EOS M4 Onyx, pushing metal AM forward with larger builds, faster throughput, and dramatically reduced waste. My first Formnex in day one was honestly amazing. The energy, the innovation, the scale, it hits you the moment you walk in. The big takeaway, additive manufacturing is scaling fast, getting smarter, and becoming more connected across the industry. And we're just getting started. Tomorrow we're visiting even more booths to bring you the most exciting tech happening at Forum Next 2025. And make sure you're following 3D Natives for more behind the scenes content, daily highlights, and exclusive interviews from the show floor. See you tomorrow for day two.